Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be trying the curl mix line and I am so excited so I cannot wait to get to it. I have two curl mix lines um, because I did their BOGO on um, Black Friday. Um, I wish that I would have been able to get two different lines to be able to try. That would have been nice, but with the BOGO you had to get the same exact system, which kind of sucked, but hey, Hopefully this one works in my hair because now I have two of them. And then um, they did give a free item. I did get the spray bottle and this is super cute. Right off the bat, I really love this postcard thing. <clears throat> Look at all these beautiful girls on here and all their textures. I absolutely love this. The inside has their university on it and then the curl mix method, which I will be using in this video. This is their lavender four-step wash and go system. Um, I really enjoy that these products are all handmade. So in the kit, you get a clarifying shampoo, a hydrating conditioner, a moisturizer, and then you get flaxseed gel, which I'm super excited because I've never tried flaxseed gel. Step one of the system is cleansing. So it says to apply the curl mix shampoo to your hands and massage the scalp with your fingertips so that's what you're going to see me do in here and i was smelling it this product smelled the most like lavender to me as i was using the shampoo um it didn't feel like it was stripping my hair but it also didn't feel like very moisturizing but that's probably because it's a clarifying shampoo step two is to condition and it says to apply it to soaking wet sections using the squishing technique um, to get it all in your hair and then use a detangling tool to work your way up from the ends of your hair and then two strand twist I don't two strand twist so I just did it the regular way um, you won't see me squishing because I just distribute the product with my tangle teaser I really did enjoy this conditioner it had more of a lotion smell to me but my hair really did like this like it was soaking it up this is what my hair is looking like um, right out the shower. The next step would be step three, and this is the moisturizer. It tells you based on your curls, um, how many pumps to put in your hair. So for the curly section, it says add one per section. So I'm gonna part my hair into two sections. I'm just gonna do sections how I usually do them. And it says one pump per section. It has a weird sound. All right, well, this is one pump. Okay. So, this has like a lotion-y type of feel to it. And it kind of smells kind of like a lotion. But all of these are supposed to be the lavender fragrance. Hmm. It's definitely not strong at all. So if you don't like strong scents, this would probably be perfect for you. It says to finger comb and allow the curls to clump. And hmm, it doesn't look bad at all. Um, my inside is a little bit like drier, so I'm gonna add more, just a little bit more, not a full pump, um, just cause it does not feel moisturized. I'm really liking the way this is making my curls feel. Like, it feels really good. It definitely does not feel like a heavy product, which I like because the heavier the product, especially on my hair, the more weighed down that it makes my hair. So I'm gonna section this top half into a section and go ahead and pin it up. All right. So with this section, I'm gonna add a pump. This pump was bigger, okay. And working it through the mids and then I kind of touch on the top, but not a lot. Just a little bit and then bring it down. This feels really good. Like, I like the way this is feeling. Just to the back. 
I'm gonna just comb the middle section together because I don't like when there's like a part back there of like my hair was in section so okay so I think this looks good so that's with the moisturizer um I really like the way that felt it really was slipping through my hair I like this and yeah it, it feels so good like I'm really liking this moisturizer it feels so light but it also feels like it's just so moisturizing I love that okay and I'm gonna go ahead with this flaxseed gel I have never used flaxy gel so I'm really excited to see what how it feels on my hair um it says use two pumps hmm we're gonna see how it feels when I just use one pump and then I'll see if I want to use two for my hair it is slippery Ooh. this is what it's looking like definitely a watery consistency hmm okay I really like the way that smells it smells better than the moisturizer yeah, I think one pump of this will be good for my hair. Wow. Wow. This, wow. This black seed might just be a game changer. They definitely feel slippery, but they definitely feel like defined. So um, I'm gonna go ahead and shake my curls. Did this say scrunch? Hmm. It does not say to scrunch. I'm gonna add a little bit more. Okay. So it doesn't say to scrunch, but I always scrunch. So um, I'm gonna scrunch. But I like the way this feels. Wow. Okay, wow. Wow, this looks bomb, you guys. I am. Look at look at this side and then look at this side. Look, just look at the difference. Like, I am highly impressed. Okay, so we're going in with one pump to start off with. Wow. Yeah, I'm pretty sure my hair is loving this stuff right now. Like, wow. Like, I'm not even over exaggerating. Like, my hair feels different than anything else I've ever put my hair. Like, my hair has never felt like this. And this is a good feeling. I'm gonna stop wowing, but I'm in awe. So for my hair, a pump seems to be good. I don't think. I want to do more than a pump. Like it's like when I put the gel on, it feels like it instantly like is clumping my curls together. Okay. And then I'm gonna go ahead and shake it a little bit, and then scratch it. Now that we added the flaxseed gel, it says hands off, no touching. Um, I scrunched, but okay. For best results, they do not recommend air drying. So I'm going to go ahead and diffuse off the camera and I will be back with the finished results. All right, so um, I know my curls are supposed to be defined and all, but um, these is define define like stringy define but when i was putting on it didn't feel like it was that much like c gel but maybe it was because i didn't touch it at all but i'm about to get to touching it because this 
this is not it it definitely has um a crunch factor so the first thing i'm going to try to do is just um scrunch it out so i'm just going to go in and try to scrunch the cast out i prefer ringlets so the next time i do this i am most likely going to use a dimming brush or something because this definitely made my hair feel stringy and it looks stringy but the scrunching is um actually helping to soften this cast so my hair feels very light even though it is not big at all go in with some of this dry oil by OGX I still really love this stuff um, and I'm just gonna take not even two pumps just to get my fingers um, and I'm just gonna go over for the rest of the cast because there's just a little bit of cast that it's not trying to scrunch out okay Okay, so the next thing I'm going to go ahead and do is shake my roots out a little bit. Um, hopefully you guys can see on camera. But I'm just going to shake my roots out. Before I flip in my head. So I just do this really light, um, not to cause frizz. It just gets my roots off my head and to the side. That made, oh wow, a good, like, that was a crazy difference. Okay, they're fluffing my roots. Um, my hair looks the bomb. Dot com. Um, it was scaring me at first because it was not looking cute. Um, now I'm gonna flip my head over and just do a little bit of picking, not a lot because it's his first day. But just a just a little bit, just a little bit. So I'm gonna stop here. Um, and yeah, let's let's talk about these products. So first. This is the bomb. So if I have to pick one that might not have been my favorite product, it would be the shampoo. I don't know. Like, it didn't make my hair feel stripped, but it didn't feel really moisturized either. But I know this is a clarifying shampoo, so I'm pretty sure that's the way it was supposed to feel. Because, like I said, it didn't feel stripped, but it definitely felt clean. My all-time favorite out of this collection would probably be... Hmm... I think I'm gonna have to go with the flexi gel because I don't know it was just it just put everything together at the end like I've like I said I've never used the flexi gel but this this is bomb.com I love this I love how light it is on my hair but to conclude this video I definitely would recommend these products I love these um I would buy these again I really love how lightweight they are so my curls definitely feel soft even though when i first got done blow drying they was looking crunchy so if you guys enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up if you like these results please give it a thumbs up um and thank you so much for watching my video um if you would like to see more videos from me and get notified every time i post go ahead and hit that red subscribe button down below and leave me a comment for more videos you would like to see bye guys